Welcome to Linux and Broadcom. Today we are going to see how to create and extend logical value by using LVM on Red Hat 8.5. Logical Value Manager is a type of storage virtualization that combines multiple hard drives or partitions into a single volume group, which then can be subdivided into logical volumes or can be used as a single large volume. First we can check the added disk using lsblk command. This is the two disk which we added, each disk 10 GB, we can make a disk as a partition. For help enter M, N is using for make new partition. Now we enter here N. By default, C. Enter 1. First sector, we need no, no need to give anything. We can just enter. Enter. Now save and quit. For one disk, we can make partition. We need to make another partition for this disk. Enter N, enter, 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 save and quit. We can successfully create the partition. Now we need to create physical volume using pv create command. We can successfully create the physical volume. Now we need to create volume group using VG create command. VG create volume group name VG0. We can successfully create the volume group. Now we next step we need to create logical volume using LV create command. LV create name of the logical volume. Size of the logical volume. From which group? We can successfully create the first volume. Now we need to create second logical volume using LV create command. Now we need to apply file system for the logical volume using MKFS command.
we can successfully update the file system for logical volume 2 now we need to mount the logical volume After mounting we can we need to restart the system. After restarting the system now we can check the disk mounted or not using lsplk command. Now we can successfully mount the disk. By this creating and extending logical volumes by using LVM on Red Hat 8.5 is completed. Thank you for watching this video and if you like it, please subscribe to our channel. To learn more tutorials, stay tuned to www.linuxhelp.com. If you have any queries, mail us to support at linuxhelp.com.